And then I looked at Manchester and I was like, wow, like it's in the top 10 universities. And what secured my choice for Lancaster was that it scored very highly for students for satisfaction and as well as that, employability was really high as well. So you know that the university supports students a lot through like the, the step from, from postgraduate to actually working in industry. Um, I was at a point in my career where I was looking to do the chartership. Um, this was a good route to chartership because the course is accredited with the uh, IMA key. Um, I thought I'll uh, try and go for it. I'm also a system engineer at Southfield, so I'm in a multidisciplined role. Um, I've already got a bachelor's degree in electrical engineering, so I thought it would be perfect to do a master's degree in mechanical engineering to supplement that. Um, so as part of my um, career development and my professional registration, um, part of that involves getting becoming chartered with the IMEKE. So as part of my personal development plan with my work, we figured that the best route for that was to take a master's degree in engineering to, to help fill that that knowledge gap, that qualification gap. Uh, and then when I've looked around, I found that Lancaster was the, one of the best ones I could find. You know how the world is evolving. It's more about projects now. Even in every, it's like any corporate sector, they have some projects coming up, be it information side, be it electronics, or be it any kind of field. So that was one thing I really wanted to learn, how people work in projects, because it's different from the organization itself running. So that was one of the ideas of getting into it. And secondly, I wanted to grow my career and progress set into energy management sector as well, like different projects that come up with renewable sites. So 